Greetings, programs, and we're back. Oh, how long has he had to uh, travel with that dagger in his leg? It's Garrett. Get the Castellan. Tell him his nephew survived. Get this man to a maester, pronto. I was too late. They were already dead. Bring the maester. Meet us in the great hall. Quickly. There we go. Oh, look at the family portrait there. Hill soldiers and a Bolton. They killed my family. And for what? My sister, she... She was only eight years old. This never would have happened with the Starks in power. It's unimaginable. Unacceptable. You have my condolences. Thank you, Mister. Mm, the blade cut deep, but I should be able to save your leg. Good. I was really hoping I wasn't having your to uh, was swift. go the... Some Call Drogo Avengers. route. No doubt the White Hills will claim it was murder. It was your family. I can't say I would have done any different than you. Yeah, it but was justice, and that's what it was. That it was justice. They got what they deserved. They did indeed. We can't let the White Hills just walk all over us. These maggots ought to help prevent infection. Oh, oh lovely. Open for me, would you? Okay. Do I have to? Press and hold X and then drag with L. Oh. Yummy. These are dark days, I fear. To lose the lord of the house and the eldest son through such a despicable act of treachery and betrayal. Greater houses than ours have fallen in times such as this. The late Lord Forrester was a good man. And poor Roderick. A serious man, but he would have made a good lord. Well, what do we do now? The future of this house is in Lord Ethan's hands now. Although he is young and altogether unprepared to lead. Right. Now, I remember we need to speak this to the uncle. A bit. Hold this for me, will you? I understand from your uncle that Lord Forrester saved your life. He did. Rather odd, though, that he chose to save you, his squire, and not his son, Roderick. Not that Roderick couldn't handle himself. He was as good with a sword as any man I've seen. It's unfortunate the Citadel yeah, that's not what happened. in the Art of Warcraft. That's not how it happened. Roderick had already fallen. Hmm. Although I'd imagine Lord Forrester would sacrifice himself to save anyone from his house, high or low. Yeah, he gave off that. He did give off that vibe. Moment now, I'd like you to walk for me first to see if you can put any weight on that leg. There you go. Go on, don't stop now. It's better to let the blood circulate. Yeah, those maggots. Look at the Lord's chair, which is going to be. Strangely empty. I'll tell you what, that living oil painting is just so... That's such a slick style. The Ironwood Grove. And that's what it's all about, the Ironwood. That's what uh, House Forrester is essentially the Castilian to. Look at... Okay, we can look at all of them. Asher. Asher. Exiled to Essos, unfortunately. Okay, so they're exiled. Talia and Ethan. Talia and Ethan. 
I suppose Lord Ethan now. Mira. Mira. Still in King's Landing, I suppose. Although, oh, we got someone in King's I Landing. Bring her home. She's in dangerous waters. Lady There's Forrester. Lady Forrester. She's always been kind to me. Treated me like I was a forester myself. Ryan? Ryan. Never easy being the fourth born son. Now I'm gonna look at him last. Roderick. He was our best warrior by far. Lord Forrester. It was an honor to squire for him. Gregor the Good. Well, learn more about the Foresters on the menu mm. codex page. You seem to be favoring it. Always sad to see a warrior lose a leg. I, I'm fine, Maestro Tengren. Look, I'll show you. Ah, we have to keep walking. Let's look at the medical supplies. Bucket. <laughs> maggots, Michael. You're eating maggots. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? I guess. What else we got here? Bandages. Yeah, you mind if I take that? That could come in handy later. And healing herbs. Healing herbs. Healing herbs. There we go. This mile. Those tricky silent H's. Okay, we got some inventory. That's good. Mm -hmm. I may be mistaken. You do seem able to put weight on it. Anything else that we need to look at here? That they'll let us? No? I think that might be it. Always explore everything you can in these games. Let's look at him. Keep moving. I need to see you walk. And we can talk to... Show the sword. Okay, let's uh, show the sword you to that? You're limping again. It's a good thing you've done, bringing that back to House Forrester. By right, that belongs to Lord Ethan now. That sword has been handed down through 50 generations of Foresters. Whoa, 50? I don't know. That's, the sword's bigger than Lord Ethan. I'll admit, you do see... Did your leg feel weak? No. I just wanted to ask you. Hmm. Yeah, why do the White Hills hate us suddenly? Why do the White Hills hate the Foresters? I think it's safe to say the feeling is mutual. There's been enmity between the two houses for as long as anyone can remember. I don't okay, so it's not suddenly. Someone which led to more killings of someone's, and then, well, here we are. Hmm. Okay, the White Hills want our ironwood. The White Hills want Forester ironwood. Ah, they'd take it all if we'd let them, especially now with the Boltons in power. And proceed to clear-cut every last inch of it until there's nothing left. Just as they've done before. Hmm. I'll go ahead and get all the information out of here. Who's the new lord of the house? Who's the new lord of House Forrester? Why, Ethan, of course. At the Citadel, I swore an oath to serve whichever noble house I was assigned. Advising the late Lord Forrester was an honor. Advising Ethan, his third-born son, is... challenging. There's still so much he has to learn, yet the very fate and future of this house rests in his hands. Well, hopefully he's not a Joffrey. Frightening when you think about it. And what will become of me now? What will happen to me now? Excellent question. Hmm. Under normal circumstances, you could join Sir Roiland and his men. Although, given the circumstances of your... circumstances, it becomes a bit tricky, doesn't it? I suppose it will be for Lord Ethan to decide. Well, Lord Forrester promoted me. At the Twins, I... I'm no longer a squire. If that matters. It might, I suppose. But I'll defer to Lord Ethan on this. No. Oh. 
Okay, can I see Ethan? Our fate's in the hands of a little one. Can I see Ethan? Is he here? He is, but I'm afraid he's indisposed at the moment. He prefers not to be disturbed while practicing his loot. Oi. Can I leave now, mister? Can I go now? I believe your leg will be fine. Any time will tell, but... Lady Forrester. Uh-oh. Welcome home, Garrett. We're all relieved to know you survived. Thank you, my lady. Talia asked to see you. Garrett, I heard what happened. Is it true? Your family... I'm so sorry. Mato. Off to bed now. Hurry on. Garrett was time for adult business. Valiantly, Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. Well, he saved my life. For. He saved my life, my lady. Yet not Roderick's. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything, I'm sure Lady Forrester would like uh, to Uh, yeah, let's try and be comforting. He fought valiantly, my lady. Of course he did. He was House Forrester's best. This has been so incredibly difficult for us, especially the children. But I was told. I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Any last words before he passed? Oh. If you can remember. You it know what? So much to the family. Yeah, nothing. Perhaps the opportunity never presented itself. You have the Forester's sword. This belongs with Ethan now. He's the new lord of the house. Thank you. Garrett. Of course, my lady. It demands a response. It's too dangerous, especially now. Now is the time to prove our strength. I'll be sure it's given to Ethan. Duncan, this was our land. They were our people. Your family. I share your outrage, Sir Royland. I do. But now is not the time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend the knee. The hell with Ramsay Snow. Oh, wow. Ramsay's, Ramsay's on his way here? Garrett, you understand what this means. You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. Oh, no. We're the ones that should be demanding retribution. This happened on Forrester land. Okay. Ramsay Snow is coming here. Aye. Yeah. He'll arrive within a week. Those men will say they were keeping the peace in the name of House Bolton. And what would you have us do? Nothing. I would have us use our heads while they're still attached to our shoulders. Garrett, That'd be merciful coming from Ramsay. These walls. Maybe you can talk some sense into your uncle. Garrett suffered enough already. You asked too much. Okay. He deserves to be heard. My uncle's right. We need to be smart. Smart. Eddard Stark was smart. And look where that got him. Speaking of so, heads. What's to be done? Okay, so that's my uncle. Ultimately, and I have to chat with him about what the king asked. Boy, you can barely hold a sword. Or what the, excuse me, what Lord Forrester told us to tell house, only him. And he needs our help. It's bad enough the Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this, but, I'll accuse you of murder and us of protecting you. The boy was just defending himself. I'm not faulting him for what he did. I'd have done the same. Yeah, it wasn't murder. It wasn't murder. It was justice. Not in their eyes. It's just the excuse Ramsay Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take. Which is why you cannot stay. Cannot stay? Ooh. Duncan, the boy has suffered enough. But, but where would I go? The one place beyond the reach of even House Bolton. The wall. You're sending him to the wall? Oh, oh dear. Done nothing wrong. Not in the eyes of the Boltons. I'm afraid it's the only solution. Especially my place is here, the though. House is so vulnerable. Uncle, my place is here. Who would defend the house? You said we need men who can fight. 
There'd be nothing we could do to protect you. To stay would bring destruction upon us all. I know that's not what you want. I know it's difficult to understand. But you Oof. must think of the house. That's right. I won't put others won't at risk. Others at risk. I'll go. I know it doesn't seem fair, but it is what's best. That settles it then. Some hard decisions today. Okay, now that we're alone, I can, can tell him what Lord horse. Forrester wanted to see. I'll see you have plenty of food, but we haven't much time. The White Hills will come looking for you. Oh, guess we don't get that chance. Oh, maybe maybe we do. to me. I'd gladly drive a sword through Lord Whitehill's heart if given the chance. I would. And God's willing, someday I will. But for now, I have House Forrester to consider first. I know you want to stay. But Lord Forrester would be proud that you're putting the interests of the house ahead of your own. Many of Lord Forrester's best men have volunteered for the war. His own great uncle was a ranger with the Night's Watch. I'll do what's I'll best. Do what's best. Which often He's a good squire. Easiest, He's got that sense of duty. Nonetheless. I've been waiting for the right moment to tell you. Here we go. What? What is it? Lord Forrester asked me to give you a message. He said, The North Grove can never be lost. Sorry, you caught me by surprise. It's not often. He said, Tell only you. If ever. He said, Tell only you. For good reason. Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just a myth made up by wildlings and fools. And it's better kept that way. I assume you kept your word. That I did. You haven't told anyone else, have you? That was a last duty. This is important, Garrett. I need to know uh, the truth. I've told no one. Of course not. I told no one. Well done. Lord Forrester was right to put his trust in you. From this day forward, this will be our secret. But soon, I may need your help. But I can't say anything more just yet. Just know the North Grove may very well be vital to the future of this house. But don't breathe a word of it to anyone at the wall. Become a ranger if you can. It will help. Man, it's... that's rough. <sighs> Iron from ice. Iron from ice. Remember, you represent House Forrester. Your actions at the wall will reflect the honor and dignity of the house. I'll serve and I'll with serve honor. with honor. I know you will. Could they at least given him a sword before he headed out to the wall? That's a long ride. And there are unhappy folks. Garrett, wait! Uh oh. Be safe. Because he's going to have to take the oath. Though, depending on the character, the oath is more what you call guidelines than actual rules.